So Josh, you've just signed your first ever professional football contract. How are you feeling? Uh, absolutely delighted, to be honest. Um, obviously, you worked so hard for so many years to get to this, and it's finally happened. So yeah, I'm very happy. How did you find out? Um, just Russ, Pete, and Twan called me into the office and just said, "Look, we're going to offer you a contract. You've done well." And that's how it happened, really. Was there any thinking? Was it on your part or was it just sign no. that paper as soon as possible? Sign it as soon as possible, yes. <laughs> All I've ever wanted to do, really. I was nervous when I walked into the office because I didn't know what was going to happen, but, you know, I'm just very happy. I think you signed um, for the club just before the end of 15 season. Yeah. And I guess this has been the goal ever since then. Yeah, as, um, obviously I signed from Hereford because, you know, what happened to the club at Hereford was pretty bad. But I moved there through a coach called Andy Bevan who brought me here and... It's always gone uphill from there, really. It's been really good. You must owe a lot to your uh, coaches, Pete, Twan, and, yeah. and the rest. Yeah, yeah, they're very happy with them. Um, so they got me to here. They've always stuck with me and worked hard. And obviously, I've had a few problems through the season, but they stuck with me. And it was really good, yeah. What's the goal now? Um, obviously, it's going to be hard to get into the first team because there's some very good players, you know. They're going to be looking to push for playoffs next season, hopefully. But. You know, I want to be a part of that, I want to be involved as much as I can and hopefully I can get a few substitute appearances or even push for the first team. You've had um, some loan stints out uh, playing yeah. men's football, how much have they helped you get to this um, point? It's, it's been a big help because really I didn't have a clue what it would be like. Obviously we played a few games in pre-season against men's teams and Northley who I went to. But yeah, it's been a real big help because the physical side and stuff, I've got used to it now and I think I can cope with it a lot more. And for your family as well, it must be a very proud day. Yeah, obviously they have to do a lot of travelling up and down the country with me, but yeah, they're over the moon for me. I mean, you just can't wait for pre-season to start now. Yeah, I know. I'll have a good off-season, hopefully keep myself fit and do a lot of work. And yeah, I can't wait for it. Speaking of Antoine earlier, you're talking about your, your cohort. You had obviously Luke Thomas who's gone to Derby. Yeah. Matt Bauer signed his professional contract last year and now yeah. you. Three out of, I believe there were six or seven of you. Yeah. It's a pretty good going. It, it is, yeah. But that's credit to the under 15 and 16 coaches that we had Dave Strain and Mike Davis and Andy Beverance. We had a really good team, and it's a shame some of the others didn't get one because they're good players. But obviously, three of us to get through the process is over the moon for it, really. Is, is it fair to say this is a moment you've always dreamed of? Yeah, oh, yeah, definitely. Ever since I was a little kid, four or five years old, I wanted to play football. It's been my dream. Well, you've made it now, Josh. Congratulations. Cheers, George. Thank you.